Hey folks, Bobby here today. Hey guys, today we are working on our 2.5 liter Ford engine and we're going to show you how to install the oil pump, so stay tuned. Okay guys, here is our oil pump here, brand new Melling pump, I do believe. And we're gonna install that today. Uh, we're gonna to torque it down to specification. We'll talk about that in just a moment, but right over here at our block. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take some of our engine assembly lube and we are going to uh, squirt a little bit in here, okay? And rub it around with my fingers. Or maybe it might be easier to just put some on my fingers. We wanna go back here where these O-rings go and we wanna make sure it's nice and slippery where it can slide right into place without uh, pinching our O-rings, okay? So let's go ahead and put some there. Put some right out here near this surface here as well. So everything just slides real good. We'll try to keep our uh, gasket mating surface relatively clean here. Although it's a rubber gasket, it wouldn't hurt if it had a little bit of oil on it as well. So let me take a look. I think we got everything lubed up pretty good there inside there. And on our oil pump here, I want to show you. It comes with a gasket, and the gasket <clears throat> has a marking on it that says block side, okay? So that's good to know. So we, we get the gasket only goes one way. And if you'll notice, there is a little U-shaped cutout right here at the bottom, okay? So it looks like the U-shaped cutout is going to go uh, right here. I went ahead and lined the pump up because it'll only go one way, okay? So we lined it up to where all of our bolt holes here meet evenly. So now it's time to go ahead and try to place this in place. But the next thing that I want to do is I want to take some of this lube. I'm squirt some on my hand here. And I want to go ahead and get some around on the uh, O-rings as well on the oil pump, okay? You could use motor oil as well if you wanted to. But we have this engine assembly lube. It's really slick stuff. And we're just gonna use that since we got it right here. So let me wipe my hand off just a little bit. And we're gonna go ahead and ease this thing in place, okay? Let's go ahead and slide it in. All right, now, here's where our gasket, we wanna make sure our gasket gets in place without getting pinched. Also wanna make sure our um, oil pump will go in all the way, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and just start maybe this upper bolt here just to keep my gasket lined up, okay? There's four bolts that hold it on. They're all the same size. They're six millimeter bolts with eight millimeter heads on them. Okay, so now I've got the gasket held in place with just two. We just got them kind of started by hand. Now I want to wiggle this pump until we get this pump seated into the bore. And right there, you felt it. It just kind of slipped right on in. The O-ring uh, went right past where it was supposed to. So we've done that by hand. We're good to go. Let's go ahead and start this bolt here by hand as well. And the lower one. See, guys, that's why you want that lubed up. Like, if that wasn't lubed up, you can, you can tell I, it took a little bit of force just to get it to go wiggle it and go in, even with it lubed. Imagine how much force it would have took without lube, and you would have uh, had a good chance of um, tearing your O-ring, okay? And you definitely don't want to do that. So here we go. We're going to go by hand here. and kind of uh, evenly snug this down. And then we'll get the torque wrench and we'll torque it to specification. Okay guys, the spec on the oil pump here is between 127 inch pounds and 141 inch pounds, I do believe. And we went ahead and set ours at 130 inch pounds. So we're gonna go ahead and torque it down, okay? And I'm gonna kind of do it 
sort of a cross reference here. Let's go this one, grab that one. Wow, that feels like that's a little, little pulling pretty hard on it, on that little bolt. There it goes. Okay, I knew it had to be almost there. There we go. And you can hear it. You don't hear it click like a foot pound torque wrench, but you hear it go just that little bend right there. Just like so, guys. So we're going to go around and check each one of them one more time. One more up here, and we're good to go. Okay, guys. Hey, that's it. Oil pump installation on a Ford 2.5 liter. Thank you for stopping by and checking out the video today. Don't forget to check that description down below. Have a wonderful day, and we'll see you next time. Take care.